If you have a mortgage, you receive a mortgage statement every month. I just got mine. So what do you do? You make the payment and just throw it out? Or do you take some time to read it? The reason I'm saying this is because it has valuable information for you to save on your taxes. I'll show you how. Up top, you see the amount due and the date. But the bottom part is where the magic happens. There are two things to keep in mind, principal and interest. Principal is the amount you borrowed and anything you pay towards your principal repays your loan. Interest is the cost of getting a loan. The good news is that mortgage interest is tax deductible for mortgages up to $750,000. Here's how to claim the deduction. Make sure you review your annual mortgage statement that tells you how much you spent in interest the entire year. You'll use that number on your 1098 form, which you'll file with your tax return. That number is going to lower your income, and lower income means lower taxes. Escrow is the amount that your loan servicer uses to pay for your property taxes and homeowner's insurance. Not all mortgages have an escrow. That just means that you have to pay your property taxes and insurance separately. Why is this important? Because homeowners can deduct their property property taxes from their income. At the end of the year, your mortgage statement will tell you how much you paid in property taxes that entire year. You need to take that number and report it on your tax return. You can deduct up to $5,000 if you're filing as a single filer or $10,000 if you're married filing jointly. And finally, now that you've become a pro at reading your mortgage statement, don't stop there. Take it a step further and figure out how much your equity is worth. Equity is the total amount that your house is worth minus what you have outstanding on your mortgage. Now granted, calculating your equity is not going to help you save on your taxes, but it is going to show you how much your net worth has grown and how much progress you've made by making timely payments every single month. Keep it up. For more videos from Explainomics and Market Watch, make sure to subscribe and keep checking back on the Explainomics playlist, and I'll see you next time.